All right, welcome to Lakeshore RV and welcome to your Montana Legacy. Coming up to the front of the camper right here. Have our battery panel. Right here we have pre-wired for a generator. Here's your outdoor quick connect hose. It's coming around the front here, on off switch. Up here is our leveling system, which operates like here's our auto level. And then here you can cycle through your different options. There's the auto hitch, which after you hit auto level and you camp, you can press this and it'll go back to where you hit auto level. Auto retract will retract all the legs. Manual level is you hit this, enter on this, and you can move up, down, right, left to get just fine tuned. And then of course, on off. Off for your front legs. You just hit front, that'll raise it, retract and front, we'll lower it your propane tank and our propane regulator which chooses which propane tank it draws from by turning that got our sewer hose and adapter up front here and here is our water closet this is our battery shutoff our low point drains this is our termination valve pulls there's a tank flush our main connection and our connection for winterizing so again that has a normal flow but you'd hook up your water here and it would just give you city water or if you fill the tank which you would turn this to fill and then put it back to normal flow and turn your pump on that would give you water that way as well there's our power cord it up there it rolls up with this button here here is our water heater and furnace the refrigerator vent for the outside this right here is an overflow for the fresh water so if you fill it up with too much fresh water you'll see water start squirting out there. Our slide out cover and awning. Our huge pass-through storage. Our other propane tank on the outside. Looks like our vacuum and TV hook up there too as well. Along the inside we have our main monitor panel which we can turn on interior lights, exterior lights, security lights with just one touch. Right now your code is 0000, which you could run your generator if you had it. Uh, HVAC, which is our our um, temperature control. There's a front AC, middle AC, and rear AC. Rear AC, control the fan and cool and heat. And adjust your temperature here. If you put it to auto, you set your temperature, it'll turn on the heat or the AC, depending on what it needs. We're just gonna turn the heat so it's nice and warm when you get here this morning. Our tank heater's here. Um, you set your awnings in and out, your slides in and out, and then of course your lights. Here's the settings. And up here tells us our gauges for how much water we have in. As you can see, there's none here. So water heater, which you can turn on gas, electric, or both. And your water pump on and off right here. There's our breaker box with our fuses and breakers. So keys there around the sink. This is our refrigerator which runs on gas or electric. Right now it's running on just electric, which you can select here to run on gas, or auto mode. Auto mode will switch between gas and electric automatically. This is our temperature control here, and our power on off. It's our freezer, refrigerator side. This is our nice big microwave. Here's our stove here, which operates a lot like an outside grill. So go down to a light position and press light and on she goes. These are pop up char charging stations. Here we have our nice big television, our chairs, our radios under there, our fireplace. It's a fantastic fan control for that fantastic fan. Up in here into the main bathroom. One thing to note in here, if you want to make sure for travel that is that was locked. Toilet cabinet. Another fantastic fan up there with control right over there. Coming into our front bedroom. The light. Nice big bed. One thing to note here is they have USB charging stations on both sides of the bed, which is nice. Huge closet. Oh. Same closet with your extra chairs. To the counters. All right, if you guys have any more questions, feel free to give the store a call at 231-788-2040. Thank you.